Tomek, uh, an unusual week with a game on uh, on Monday. But during the week we played a friendly against uh, Fortuna. What are your views on uh, on that game to start? Yeah, every time we have a longer week, um, <coughs> we try to use it to to develop the players, develop the team, give playing time to to players who maybe played a little bit less in the last weeks. Um, so we had the opportunity to, to play Fortuna. Um, last moment we had to switch from natural grass to artificial because it was raining so much. Um, yeah, it was an interesting game for us because we played the first 30 minutes with a team that was close to the starting lineup we had against the Grafschaft and then um, we started to make uh, substitutions. So um, yeah, most of our players were on the pitch. Um, many of them got 60, 45 minutes um, against a good competition. You know, it was the team of Fortuna without the starters, but all their players already played a lot of Eredivisie games this season. So it was a competitive game. Um, especially good to see some of our players who in the last weeks um, did not um, did not play so much to have good performances. Um, again, a game where we uh, created a lot of chances, a lot of really, really good chances um, and were able to use some of them. Um, maybe in the first part of the game uh, we were defensively not as good as in all the last uh, competition games. Uh, but for us, it was a good test. Um, good test just to to see where everybody is and to um, yeah, play against a good team that develops us. Yeah, we pulled the game over the line in the in, in, in the final uh, uh, minutes. Uh, does it make you happy that uh, the Serbs are are doing it in those moments? Um, it's not about happy. It's just about progress and development. And we we know how hard we have to work to you know to become a good team. Um, we are making we are ma making steps. A game like this um, is a good sign. Um, all the last friendly games, whether it was um, now this year Young Utrecht, whether uh, whether it was uh, NAC, uh, now Fortuna, uh, we managed to win. Um, so this is also an important step uh, because even in the beginning of the season we played a lot of good friendly games, but we never won them. Um, now we're starting to win those games. Um, and uh, yeah, in the end, it's all just about uh, the development of the players, the team, um, not losing, not losing focus of this process. Um, even in moments like this, where we're in the league, uh, we are fighting hard to get our wins, uh, where we are fighting hard to, you know, improve our position in the table. Um, we cannot, we cannot forget uh, the main goal is to develop the players. Yeah, if we look to the, to the last games, uh, scoring goals was uh, the most difficult uh, part. Um, does it give confidence to the group that you, uh, in, a, in a friendly, again, you create the chances and you score three goals? Yeah, I think the most important part is just creating chances, creating chances and having the confidence that um, if you look at our chances from the last three games um, and look, you give us the, those chances one more time, we score more goals. Um, sometimes it's a process uh, for young players. I have coached so many really, really good strikers and they all went through different phases. So this is normal. Um, for us, it's really important um, that the mindset stays right. Uh, the mindset must be to be really eager to get those chances again. To, to For us, it's so important um, in stretches like this to keep doing the good things. Uh, because, of course, in stretches like this, you have a million people saying what what we are doing wrong, what what uh, needs to get better. Um, it's it's easy to have an opinion. The most important thing is to keep doing the good things again and again and again. Um, and at the end of this, we will come out with with goals. We will come out with uh, chances, um, and we will you know we will um, win games again. Yeah, and on, on Monday we play uh, we play Groningen. Um, if you go back in the time and look back at uh, the game we played there, is that your favorite memory at FC Den Bosch so far? Like the game and everything around it? It was a good win, important win, and also a deserved win. Um, for us as a team was, was really showed us uh, what we can achieve together um, in our best moments when everybody's, uh, everybody's at his best. Mm, yeah, it's a very, very good game. Uh, I mean, everybody could su uh, see yesterday on TV um, how well uh, Groningen has developed. Also, 
when you compare to the first team, it's almost like a new team. Uh, there's still three, four players left on the field who played against us, but they uh, found a good way to bring in a, a lot of uh, young players. They play with high energy. Of course, I think the last game in the league, they lost. Um, there was one at Dordrecht, and then probably in the last 20 games, they maybe lost just this one game. So they are very stable. Mm. And for us will be a great test. I think uh, we are really looking forward to this test uh, here at home. If you look at our games, whether we played Roda or, or um, some of the other good teams, uh, yeah, we are, we are competitive. We will be competitive on Monday. Um, it will be a great game and uh, we are really looking forward to it. Yeah, you already mentioned uh, the team of Groningen that plays now is a very different team compared to uh, when we played them in September. Um, what makes it so different? You already mentioned like young players, but what's the, 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 the key point for, for them to get in the results now compared to the beginning of the season? Yeah, sometimes it just needs a little bit of time for, for, for a team, for a new coach, for, um, you know, for it to click. Um, I think in this moment they found a good balance between the experienced players and the young players. They have some some good talent and some really good um, some really good um, experienced players. The mix makes it, and then they are also in a good way, in a good in a good moment. Um, it's it's um, in certain ways similar to us. Um, you know, when we look at our season and progressing from from period to period. Um, we are in the last uh, probably, I don't know, 10 games, um, so much more competitive in every game, really, really with a real chance to win the games. Um, not only are we playing good football, but we are um, yeah, just stable as a team. Uh, we are able to really perform in a, in a very mature way. Um, there's one more step for us to go, which is now to turn those performances um, into more wins because I think this is what we all want this is what the players um, are working so hard for um, and look this is this is also part of the development this is just sometimes um, you just need to keep going um, and um, teams go through those processes um, and we we will also uh, in the last part of the season um, see a next step for us yeah and if we go back to the game for uh, for Friday. Um, you already mentioned the cup run of, uh, of Groningen, which ended uh, last night. Uh, do you see it as an advantage, a team that played more games, intense games with disappointments in the final minutes? Or do you think like, hey, they had this run, they keep on going now? Um, I don't know. I don't know. It's not my it's not my worry, not my problem. For us, it's a big challenge after the Grafschaft, you know, to to be in a, in a way with the same energy, with the same confidence. Uh, to continue to play like we played first half in the Grafschaft. Uh, this is our focus. This is the only thing that we can control. Um, we, um, yeah, we really liked uh, our last home games, whether it was Cambuur, whether it was <coughs> uh, Roda. Um, I think our game against Helmet at home was really good. Um, and we need to continue in this way, how we play. Um, focus on us, focus on the things we can control and um, be ready for Monday.